set phasers to frag. <laughs> Welcome to WatchMojo.com, and today we'll be counting down the top 10 best Star Trek video games. In the days to come, you will be tested well beyond your current limitations. Number 10, Star Trek The Next Generation, A Final Unity. Captain's Log, Stardate 47111.1. Kicking off our list is the Star Trek point-and-click adventure game with the then-breathtaking motion video. Starring the voices of the entire TNG cast, the majority of the gameplay experience takes place in the form of puzzles the crew must face during away missions. It appears that the panel has malfunctioned. It is still active, even though the rot has been removed. Even though the bits on the Enterprise are merely a sort of waiting room, there's a lot to experience in this playable Star Trek episode. Very well. But this decision will be on your head. Number 9, Star Trek Starfleet Command. A starship combat simulator released at the start of the golden age of Star Trek games, this one was based on the tabletop war game Starfleet Battles. Simulating everything from ship operations to fleet warfare, it became an instant classic due in no small part to the authenticity it conveyed. Number 8, Star Trek Online. This massive online multiplayer game ties directly to the 2009 film and explores what happened in the original timeline after Romulus exploded. I promised to save the Romulan homeworld. I failed. Centered on a major crisis threatening the galaxy, the game gives each character a starship and a choice of several races to inhabit. A mix of third-person and flight-based action, it's free to play and allows players to pool resources and work together. You are a Starfleet officer. Lieutenant Yoshi, alert Starfleet. We have engaged the Borg. We are the Borg. Number seven, Star Trek Klingon Academy. While there have been quite a few Starship combat simulators in the franchise, this one stands alone by placing you in the role of a young Klingon warrior in preparation for a future conflict with the Federation. One day there will be a war with our true enemy, the Federation. There are those who disagree, but it will happen. The successor to Star Trek Starfleet Academy, this massive open world game came on a staggering six discs and featured a first person view, detailed damage modeling, and refined gameplay. Number six, Star Trek Deep Space Nine, The Fallen. This third person shooter centers on Starfleet competing with other factions to attain three pieces of an apocalyptic weapon. Within its compelling campaign, players take on the role of Captain Sisko, Kira, and Worf each with a different standard weapon and their own unique level objectives. Despite odd gameplay quirks, this game had plenty of action and memorable scenarios. But my advice is to avoid confrontation if possible. Thanks, old man. I'll stay out of trouble. Cisco out. Number five, Star Trek Armada. This real-time strategy game let you not only play as the Federation, but also as the Klingons, Romulans, and the Borg. Set during the next generation, it focuses on an all-out intergalactic war that has you experience the conflict from every perspective. Its most memorable moment is definitely when Picard is forced to confront a clone of his Locutus Borg counterpart, and the ensuing time travel to undo the harrowing assimilation of Earth. Number 4, Star Trek Bridge Commander. With the tagline, you are the captain, you have the con. This space combat simulator places you as a newly promoted captain assigned to investigate a mysterious new threat to the Federation. Replicating the feel of the Next Generation era, it's controlled by having you instruct your crew, as well as switch between bridge and exterior space view. The true commander's experience, several sequels were soon to follow. Yes, sir. Number three, Star Trek Voyager Elite Force. What are you doing? This PC and PS2 Trek game broke with convention by taking the series into the realm of the first-person shooter. With a story centered on players acting as a member of a new security force, you are charged with defending Voyager while it is trapped within a ship graveyard. Sure, the graphics haven't aged well, but the gameplay is top-notch, and it successfully captured the terror of confronting the Borg head-on. Ah! Thanks, Monroe. I'll get Odell back to the ship. Number two, Star Trek 25th Anniversary. Combining the best flight simulator at the time with an authentic feeling point and click adventure, this game sports seven distinct missions, or episodes if you prefer. With the CD version voiced by the original cast, it's a fun and intelligent groundbreaker that was the first to make the Trek gaming experience enjoyable and respectable. 
Too bad the end was nearly as unwinnable as the Kobayashi Maru, am I right? The challenge, Mr. Spark, is to learn from your mistakes and make yourself a better person. It's something we can do on our next mission. Want a bet? Number one, Star Trek Judgment Rights. Beaming up to the top spot on our list is the spiritual successor to the 25th anniversary and the definitive game for those looking to recapture the feel of the original series. Consisting of eight missions, now with an ongoing story arc, it one-ups its predecessor in every way. This is achieved through its improved puzzles and production values, which create a thoroughly engaging and pitch-perfect Star Trek experience. My God. Agree with our list? Which video game experience transported you to the Star Trek universe the best? For more great top tens, be sure to subscribe to WatchMojo.com. Had you followed standard hazard team procedures, you may have survived the simulation and achieved your mission objectives. Yes, sir.